Good morning guys. I hope you're having a wonderful 4th of July weekend. Today we are replacing our mailbox which is probably over 30 years old. Uh, the shingles are starting to fall apart. It's pretty wobbly. We're going to dig this out, pour some cement, and sink a pressure treated 4x4 post in and then install this mailbox. We'll come in and paint the water meter green, which we've always done, but you can tell it needs to be refreshed. We will run drip off a old sprinkler line in the back here, and we're gonna plant it up. Then there's some river rock behind me, and we're gonna carry that on down. So I'm gonna set the camera up so we can get started. We're converting this sprinkler head to drip. So I'm going to take the sprinkler head off. This connector, and I know it's hard to tell because it's already attached to the, the drip tube. This connector and this elbow came as an assembly kit. So it's a swivel elbow, whoops, sorry about that, assembly kit, and this fits both half inch and three quarter inch. Let me get this connector on down here. And I just have to attach this elbow to the connector down here. I'm gonna cap this off with this clamp. So I'm gonna slide this down real quick over and now I can run the emitter tubing from here after I clamped it off I went ahead and put a staple in here then I connected the emitter tubing that has 
emitters every six inches. So this will get plenty of water. Now what I'll do is I'll bury this in dirt a little bit, and then we're gonna go ahead and finish it off with river rock. This project took us a couple of days, and that's only because we started it late in the afternoon one day and it was almost 107, and so we called it quits. However, it shouldn't take you but less than one day. With the price of the mailbox, the beam that we uh, put into the ground, uh, the quick set concrete and the rock and the plants and the spray paint, all of it was less than $200. We landed up ordering a ton of the river rock, but you can buy it by the bucket. You can buy it by the half ton. You're not locked into buying a, a large amount. And uh, I, I'm just gonna say, I'm not sure if we caught the footage of me painting it green, but that's because we've normally always put grass right here. And after painting it, I realized, well, that's not gonna look right. So we landed up picking up a can of granite spray paint. And I think it blends in perfect with the rock. Um, by the by next year each of these society garlic plants should start touching each other and so it'll be this little circle of greenery with the purple flowers and um, I think it's a much better improvement than what we had because the other mailbox was slowly well I should say quickly falling apart thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you soon bye